Community Matters tonight. The steel framing of the Greater Burlington YMCA's new facility is complete. The organization held a topping off ceremony this afternoon to celebrate the building's next step. Local 22's Courtney Kramer has the story. After years of planning, the Greater Burlington YMCA is one step closer to completing its new downtown Burlington facility. The more the building looks like a Y, the more people get excited about the Y. The organization marked the occasion with a topping off ceremony Thursday afternoon. It's an old European style tradition where the last beam of a structure is decorated with flags and a small tree before being raised in front of the community. When you put up the steel of a building, it's a milestone. Right, it's the infrastructure, it's the skeleton of the building, one of the most important pieces. The celebration comes one year to the day after the YMCA first publicly announced the building plans. Everyone at the ceremony got to write their name on the final steel beam before construction workers raised it into place at the highest point of the building. YMCA is the heart of so many of our key challenges uh, as a community, whether it is about child care, whether it's about health, or whether it's about uh, just having a convening place. The 50,000 square foot facility will be just a few hundred feet away from the Y's current location on College Street. It'll feature modern group exercise facilities, a fully ADA compliant space, and an expansion of the Y's child care program. 50 new infant toddler seats, which is new capacity for the hardest uh, early childhood seats to achieve. That funding made possible through the city's first step scholarship program announced on Wednesday. Courtney Kramer, Local 22 News, Burlington. Well, YMCA staff members say the facility is on track to open sometime early next year, and you've got to love the miniature hard hats the oh, kids had on. They were so cute.